All right, here we are, guys. Hold two. Just going to set up this rocket here real quick. We're going to go rocket. Whoops. Let me go ahead and open that. I can never find the right spot. Let's see if I can't get you guys this shot real quick. Now, when you only have a Rocket 9, you only have 70 backspin, which means you're going to have to play it just a little bit more aggressive. Ideally, you'd want to play this with a Rocket 10. If you have a Rocket 10, you'll probably want to use around 8 bars of backspin, I would recommend. What I'm going to need to do is land it very close to the front, a little bit more than I typically feel comfortable doing. So it's going to land right around here. Keep in mind that when you move down, we're going to need to play this probably about 1.5 per ring. As soon as I move down to lower ground here, which is down here, it's going to land short. So you see that I'm actually pulling up, making sure that my angle's up here because I'm worried that the ball's going to land short. So this is more or less what I'm shooting for. I did hit a great ball, which is probably going to cost me. But there you can see how it barely hops up. And it does, it, it, had I hit perfect, you know, it would have shot right towards the hole and given me a good chance. But I would also have to land very close to that front edge. Keep in mind that you need to, if you don't have enough backspin, which I only have six and a half bars, um, then you need to pull at an angle and make sure that that, because it is going to land short, that ball is going to land short when you move down into the water. As soon as you move that target into lower ground, the ball's going to land short. It's not going to carry the way that it shows on the ball guide. So you need to make sure that you correct for that. So you can see that mine almost, it barely crept up. So you, I'd have to make sure that I always pull at at least that angle. So keep that in mind. Good luck with this hole, guys. And as soon as my opponent hits this one, um, this, is, this is doable. It's feasible. Um, what I'll typically try to do is run this into the fringe with the second hop it's a tough shot though it's not something i typically do looks like nope that's not what you want to do so typically what you'll want to do is try to bank that second hop into the fringe when you go for that shot it's very tough to do it needs to hit perfect for it to work out but good luck there guys and i will catch you guys next time for future guides